Hi there. For anyone new to the channel, I'm Helen Baines, the Happy Healthy Homemaker. And I just wanted to hop on and share a little story with you guys. Um, so toys was one of my biggest headaches as far as home organization goes. It felt like I was always picking up toys. The kids just seemed to have everything everywhere. And whenever I say to them, kids, come on, it's time to clear up your toys. It was like, take back to my childhood. I was the child that had a dreadful room. So organization does not come naturally to me. And as soon as my mom said, come on, it's time to clear up your room, Helen, there'd be a fight. I wouldn't know where to start. And I guess that's where maybe this whole process of organization started from. How could I set my children up for success? Because I think as a homemaker, um, not everything should fall on you. If you try and do everything for the whole household, you're going to burn yourself out. So I had to find a solution and that's what I'd like to share with you. So this evening, we're in the process of moving. The house is in upheaval. There's stuff everywhere. And the kids' toys was like the biggest disaster it's been for weeks. And, you know, I said to them, come on, kids, we've got to clear this up. We've got to get this sorted out. Because what I notice is when things aren't organized, the kids play less. They're less settled, much like me. If my house is disorganized, I'm less organized. I just can't seem to get my head in the game. So what I want to share with you is how do I organize my children's toys so that when I say, hey, kids, it's time to tidy up your toys, they're like, yeah, mom, we got this. So let me get started. So first of all, it came down to looking at the toys. Um... What toys did I spend longer picking up than my kids spent playing with? Because the whole idea is to entertain the kids, not for us to be picking it up or causing a fight. So we simplified it down. So I have a few categories. So I have, let me think, I'm just in the process of switching from the toddler toys to getting into some of the older categories. So I'm going to go with toddler toys for now, but I'll pop on and do another video with the next step toys when we get to that stage. So the toys that we decided to keep were Duplo. Um... The train, those wooden train. Um, dolls, dress up or like make believe. These are just the categories we have. I'm just looking over there now. <laughs> Playmobil, the one, two, three stuff. Um, I should have looked at this before I did the video. We had two more. The tools and you know, like all those like fine motor kind of stuff, uh, gross motor skills. I have a box of them. I just call it random toys and anything else that doesn't fit in one of these categories goes in it. Um, the stacking beakers, that kind of thing are in there. Then we have, I'm going to pause and I'm going to go check. Okay. I'm over by the toys now and you have to excuse the mess of the background. Like I say, we're in the middle of packing. So we got the food stuff like play food and then we have Hot Wheels carts. So what I did is I grabbed those Kallax units from Ikea. You don't want to overcomplicate it because I think the more that we overcomplicate it, the harder it is for our kids. So I'm going to flip you around and just let you see how easy it is. I just pull out the boxes and the kids pop all the toys in. Here we go. So they just pop them straight in. Here's the Hot Wheels one. You'll just see everything's just put in the box and the food's so when I say, kids, come on, it's time to clear up, we just pull out those eight boxes along our two Kallax units, the kids pop everything in, and suddenly, ta-da, the mess is all cleared up. So I hope that's given you guys some inspiration if toys are a huge issue in your household. And if you'd like some more support with us, then do reach out. I love to hear from you all. Have a great evening, everybody. Follow my channel for more um, videos like this and to learn about our exciting move that's coming up as we are in the process of minimizing and becoming more intentional with our life and our time. Have a good one, everyone. Bye for now.